Hi everyone and welcome back to another day of ground hopping through Silesia. I said I want to do it weekly but I had some free time this weekend and this is a pretty big match in the lower leagues. Ever since I started this channel whenever this match came around uh, people were leaving in the comments like go to this match go to this match go to this match but I never really had the time for it until today. Let's head to challenge for the Vialki Derby challenge. It sounded very Italian. Let's go. So welcome to the town of Challenge. I'm a bit early, still an hour to kick off. So the derby today is between Seke S. Challenge and Gornik Piaski. Gornik Piaski is from a historic minor neighborhood between Challenge and Sosnovitz. Today's match is for the Klasa Ograkova and the win for them today could move them up towards the third place positions. Challenge is just like any other place in the Dombova Basin, a stronghold for Zagonga Sosnovets. So I'm expecting some ultra activity. Sekas is a fan club. Uh, I don't know if that's the right term for it, uh, but also this week they signed an agreement to have a partnership with the Academy of Zagonga Sosnovets. Klasa Ograkova is the sixth level of the Polish football. It's that low that on footballogy it doesn't even show this match. As you can see behind me, like stadium wise for sixth level, it's much better than last week's Unia Dombrov Gunica. Quick goal, second minute, was a low cross from the right wing and the attacker could just walk through the defense and score a tap in.
41. minuta spotkania. Queue bus, so I was okay. I had better. Uh, it was 15 zlotys. Luckily, there wasn't a big queue uh, because right around the corner there's a liquor store and everyone's going there to get their beers. Uh, because you can bring your own alcohol, it seems. So, match itself is pretty interesting. It could have been actually for like 4 4, I think, or half times. That was coming most of the track and a half. Well, that was a pretty fun game. First half was definitely for Sick AS, but in the second half, Gornik played much better. Uh, but Sick AS also had a lot of opportunities, uh, at least two penalty shots that the referee didn't want to get. For the ground hopping ratings, I have to give the stadium and the facilities four stars. Like the field was nice, uh, the stadium itself, seats, they had an actual toilet building. Uh, yeah, four stars. The only downside I could give is like today with the rain. Now it's not really that comfortable. And the running track for the catering, I'm going to give it two stars uh, because there was basically only kielbasas. Um, I did not see any drink options. Right? You could bring your own drinks, but I'm not going to add that to the rating. And then lastly, the accessibility. Uh, I'm going to give that four stars because I had the bus directly from in front of my house straight to Chalot. And depending on the traffic, it only takes like 30 minutes. Overall, I would rate it high three and a half star. I oh, know, screw it. Uh, four stars, four stars. And especially as long as these two teams are in the same league, definitely give it a try, the Chalot's Derby. There's a good rivalry between both teams. They have a good group of fans. There was police and security just in case, but there were no actual hostilities between the two groups. That was the second episode of ground hopping around Silesia. Keep the suggestions coming. I saw some good ones. Tomorrow I'll be back with a regular episode. So stay tuned for that one. And yeah, see you tomorrow. Bye bye.